All, All right. right. Welcome back, everybody. We're checking right into the hotel uh, as you're checking out the first round of this here second map on SYN Toast. It's looking like Demi Falcon is going to go ahead and pick off Nasty God, and we'll leave that down to a 4v3. Vincent's are down. Floor is burning up. Yogurt's pushing up with his shotgun. Got a good. Got a really good shotgun land there and lands the melee down with the meat shield. This is mayhem at the nades right now. Prevail, full four, four and a half point is trying to bust that one too. Man, that was just a complete bud land, yeah, Rob. Man. I don't even think it was. I don't. There wasn't any potential to give the play by play by that at all. <laughs> We do, we do our best in those situations. Yeah, absolutely. So as we see, SYN coming in completely dominant as they go ahead and put the first round or first point up on this here and map. To a boom shot round. Let's see the breakdown in players. We got four outside coming out from uh, Friendship Five Stars. Let's see if they're able to secure the boom. They're going for the uh, revive train strategy, and they are going to secure it. So. Oh, man, yeah, prevail is really taking out Nancy on the 1v1. Ooh, team kill by that frag. 4v2 situation with Rockets. Prevail showing that Lancer can win that 1v1 situation with a desperation shotgun pusher. And there is the round. Yeah, that is something I really like to see. Coming there on a boom shot round, it was a really secure, nice play. They were able to get the downs. Nasty lost the 1v1. They put the push on. They were able to take that boom and pull it out without even having to really use it. Uh, and just like that, yeah, a good point. just like that, five stars is going to go ahead and put the first map or first, you know, tie-breaking round on. Yeah, knowing your opponent has the boom definitely changes your mentality as you go into the remaining of the round. So here it comes Digger round for uh, Blue Series able to shoot some off right immediately into the room. That's a really good Digger, but there's a double kill off of it. Made its way for a while. Good Digger, good play. Demi Falcon. And here, Demi Falcon, here's, they have to push Triangulate. Is moving up here, able to pick off one 3v2 situation. They might reset and try to get uh, tour control. Violate saw that 1v1, and he knew he just wanted to back off and try to go ahead and say, all right, let's get this team reset. But we're going to go ahead and see it down on the map. Strangulate able to pick off one. The movement is still coming down, and the Lancer fire is no joke as Strangulate's going to go ahead and get picked off. And it's Nasty down to a 2v1 situation. Nasty with that host fire. Is he going to be able to pick off the Lancer kill? No, he's not. Oh, that guy's four-pointed, man. He almost got him down, too. He sees the 1v1 opportunity, goes ahead and pulls in, and just like that, five stars fully be able to get back to their 2v1 sitch. They're going to go ahead and try to pinch Nasty off. Nasty trying to get the movement down. Is shot. it going to be a pick off one? No, it takes the four point, and the backup still happens. Nasty not successful in the 2v1 attempt, and five stars going to go ahead and take the lead 2 1. Really exciting round, opened up with that digger strategy. Uh, you know, everybody sort of congregates to that center incense, so once in a while you sneak in that digger play, and it, uh, it proved worthy that time. All right, and back to a boom shot round, Rob. It's looking like we're going to take the 3v1. Nasty losing the 1v1. The last time we saw this side, though, it's looking like all three going to be pushing up into the ascent, and Prevail going to go ahead and get down. SYN Yogurt able to pick off that kill. Violation works the magic there. around, wasn't happening. Strangulated will take it out, 4v2. Blow zeros, blowing zeros, picks off Nasty on the inside, and blowing zeros just continually trying to pop. Jump and touch every single wall here on the outside. Yeah, he's really working as best as he can, oh uh, just moving around, trying to land a uh, trying to land a chunk there. Oh. Uh, Falcon in a one v two situation, and I'm curious where the rockets are right now. So let's see. There's a rotation toward Boom. Uh, it may not have gotten picked up yet. There it is. So the yogurt able to secure it there. There's one rocket. He's got a one v one situation in the house though. Let's see where he opts to go. He's switching things up, pushing the Boom player, really psyching him out here. Chokes the Boom. Let's see if he can hold right hand here and secure it. We're really Strangulate is nowhere to be found, so I don't oh. know where the teamwork was in that 2v1 situation, but we now suddenly have not only uh, is it a 1v1, but this guy uh, has control of the boom shot. Apparently he can't shoot his gun. Okay, so there was technical difficulties before uh, <laughs> All before right. the you know the, twi the Twitter rants and everything. Uh, there was a controller malfunction, so I don't know the results of this round. But You would think that he was playing from Canada. <laughs> <laughs> For everybody out there that knows Stragulate, nothing new, but it's looking like his controller flows. And, uh, I mean, when I blow 1v1, one one sometimes I just, ah, crap. Can't move. So we're on Strangulate. He's going to go ahead and continue with the procession, and I'm wondering if it was just a round glitch or however it worked out. Yeah, he's an in-game glitch at the moment. All right, so, so all they're playing three the four strong. Yeah, Prevail, he, he's holding perch. He's not grabbing the torque yet. He's gonna try and you know just work the angle since everybody's here. So it's more crucial that he gets his lancer fire down. Yep, just like that. Nancy, or, uh, Strangulate probably not too worried as he knows that he is 
you know, one of the major factors of Synergy or the rest of his team. So he's pretty confident that they it can be a 3v4 situation win. and SYN might be very Why well coming out of this. Resist? And then after that, I'm assuming that maybe we'll just get this map fixed. <laughs> so we're looking for a 3v4 stomping right now. Yeah, I'm not sure the the current status of the situation, but either way, uh, every player is moving. Is, is he sitting in spawn? No, everybody's out, so here we go. 3v1 on. Uh, you know, Looking like is playing in that 1v1 spot. Prevail, Prevail going, going down, trying angle. to get that rush off into the incense. Uh, and it's like a Violates. Two come out. Nasty picking off blow and zero. So we're into a 4v1 situation with Demi Falcon on the outside. And SYN doing what they do is they fully come together and are doing this 3v4. Shorthanded with just simple callouts. Some yeah, really solid play, there. yeah, exactly. Some really solid play coming down to the incense. Violates probably pushing it a little too hard without able to be fully secure well, that, uh, that path. Any sort of time you have like a disadvantage like that, there's nothing you do. Just do, you know, don't sit down. Just use yourself as a shield. Do something to add to uh, you know your team. Just increase your chances of winning. So here we go. Uh, dig around again. It's shot off into the middle. Definitely a, a late digger this time. So that's not going to hit anybody. We got Incense uh, in the hands of Prevail, and he's going to move outside. And they got a player by himself out there. Let's see if they take advantage of that number. So it's looking like we got two diggers and five stars in, in control of uh, Incendiaries as well. Full 4v4 situation. And uh, it's looking like Noctis Hero just hanging out, keeping the tags going on. And five stars setting up a full outside strat. Yeah, he uh, let's see. Noctis feels pretty safe out there with his Lancer uh, against a digger, which he could, you know, has enough time to react to, the same as an Incense grenade. So we got Torx Revan from Nasty as he uh, as he rotates around the map a little bit. Let's see, searching for another another angle from the front door. There's a two v one situation up here at the desk. And let's see if they take advantage of this prevail alone. Wow, oh. really key incense. That was a good toss. Nasty Almost making had it. a really solid read right there yeah. on that back roll. And uh, we're still four v four strong as both teams are in control of power weapons. And it's just pretty much pretty much anybody's round here at the moment. We're just looking for the proper pickoffs. And it's looking like SYN finally starting to make their push here into the hotel lobby. Yeah, interesting setup. Diggers are going to come back up soon, so that's definitely on everybody everybody's mind. Is nasty is starting to get a little bit aggressive with that tour. And that's number two if you're counting on the incense. There's no more power weapon thing. Uh, SYN in control right now. I believe there's still diggers in this game, so. There's a down, so everyone's going to focus on this. We've got a lot of Lancer support fire. Strangler's going to be able to crawl back to his team. Violet's able to tap Lancer somebody out. down. Violet's actually tapped out Strangler right there. Yogurt able to pick off Prevail. Prevail trying to get a push in, and we're dropped down to a 3v3 situation as Five Star is going to go ahead and continue to be pulled out. Demi Falcon just waiting. Just nasty guy. Showing no respect. Comes off. Gets picked off on the right hand by, by Violet's. And just like that, we're dropped into a 2v2. Yeah, we just saw Blowing Zeros take the incense and get out, survive that match. So they have a 2v2 situation with, with the incen incendiary grenades. Yep. I think if they would have held off on the incense just a little bit longer, another play would have might uh, uh, a better play could have evolved from there. Strangulate actually getting down, and, you know, we could have done a little timing game, waiting game, maybe picked off the double and or, if not, secured Strangulate instead of the tap. tap right. Now we are seeing uh, Digger and incense in the hands of Friendship 5 Stars. And Synergy, uh, Yogurt picking up Torque. So we got we got quite a match here. This could stall out a little bit. We'll see if any some key key matches, uh, key Torque both shots get landed as we progress with just uh, under probably two minutes. Shooting All right, there's out. some there's the lobs I like seeing right wow. there, and it actually did exact point, yeah. work. Rob, me and when Fighter Strike and I were talking, we were talking about where are the lobs, and these guys are from Gears <laughs> War One, and we very well do know much about it. So you just saw it go down right there, saw that four point. If they would have known, I'm sh pretty sure that there could have been some nice plays made. Absolutely, that was that was very close to stealing a kill like that. So they're focusing their uh, their attention both. Both power weapons to one location on the map, trying to clear out through. Um, obviously, with with members dead on each team, everybody knows where everybody is. So it's going to come down to uh, taking the push at the correct time. So still in a two v two. Yogurt trying to get some of that pistol fire out, throws out a little two point, and the cross is finally all. But Yogurt pulling out of position, and it's still two v two. We're going to go ahead and stay here at the stalemate, waiting on the power weapons to come back up on spawn. Violates a really key digger right here. So SYN holding shotguns, uh, awaiting the push. They're going to re-up on incense, and they are trapped up at Torque. And it's not fun when, when incense are coming. 
So they we'll go ahead and offer a push out. We'll see. We'll go ahead and press the back button here. See how much time is left on the map, and we're coming down to just about a minute. So nasty, and uh, yogurt. Hey, you know, GB duos. They they play pretty pretty often together. Maybe we might see a little unorthodox pushing. But then again, we are at three to three. Yeah, this is a this is a big round. It's okay to take the draw and, and really take advantage of your full team uh, w with everybody alive. But again, uh, you know, if, if, if somebody sees an opportunity on death cam, uh, it shouldn't go unnoticed here. Wow, that oh. was a really sneaky incense. Yeah, Almost really caught him. So really solid incendiary. He, it, it didn't look like he got the reach that he quite wanted. But uh, we got Digger actually getting ready to come up on spawn. 25 seconds left in the map. Wondering, we're at Digger. I'm wondering if SYN says, okay, okay, they're going to send somebody in, try to make a quick, nice play happen. Yep. If not, it's okay. We're going to go following into a boom round. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you can be hero in this type of situation. Something with Digger, you can get very aggressive and just push. Make sure you shoot all three off and just try and pick up a kill. So here we go, it's just winding down the clock, five seconds left. Nox is shooting up with the Lancer, blowing, blowing, able to go down. Uh, wasn't going to start down. He does die there, but stalemate ensues, and we are heading into another round seven. All right, so back to full strength on a boom shot round. We'll go ahead and see what kind of plays we got come up and develop, and it's looking like we're going to be running a 3-3. Actually, a little change in the plans here as Yeah, they ran this Five earlier Stars today, and they did four to the outside. Although you had mentioned they didn't use any, but they did secure it last time. So let's see if they get some change revives going. The focus is absolutely there. The nades are coming out. He's good. The downs are coming down, and just like that, he came out for fully secure. Oh, at the sacrifice of one player, though. So, oh, oh that, that's fine trade. It's still 3v3 with Rockets. Uh, it was fine to take him out. I mean, it was worth it. The guy was rushing him for the kill. So we got 3v3. Smart decision. Boom shot. Play make control. Goes. Let's see the rotation. If someone grabs Snipe sooner, they're just going to try and hold the uh, map advantage a little bit. Here comes the rotation. So See, now we have something actually kind of cool, Rob, because they, Synergy does know that they are in possession of two more boom shots. They do know that they have a long-range rifle. So they are, all, especially on Hotel, boom, we secure a power weapon, we make our way to the outsides, and then from there, we wait on boom shot to come up. And, uh, you know, as far as distance and separation goes for that rocket, they yeah. have the opportunity to be getting out of the way. <laughs> Yeah, and I mean, at this moment, I'm, I'm just going to try and move out and uh, see if he can steal a skull here. Yeah, these As are he really is aware of a player there at the, uh, oh, wow. We definitely want to see it. Rockets are going to respawn here, so, you know, with with uh, Friendship Five Stars hanging out outside, you know, <laughs> re up on five rockets is never a bad thing. Yeah, um, I, I agree to that. Yeah, nasty, I'm sorry, uh, SYN and the rest of these guys really do need to start pushing outside of the hotel. But then again, they very well could be trying to be playing slow, give Noxious here a little time to be a power weapon player and do what he does, maybe do crack a skull. But, uh, yeah, boom shot is coming up here. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Soon. We still got a little bit of time on it, but uh, Noxious being uh, – power weapon player that he is so will be aware of you know keep an eye on boom and he might be able to steal a headshot there as well the player with the rockets able to pick up the ammo quicker than anybody else so we'll see uh we'll see if they decide to divvy up the rockets into two players hands or uh, just stack one guy with five so here comes the push outside the spawn here all right just like we got done talking about they're going to go ahead and they know exactly what time weapons are coming up noxious hero just barely missing uh, but he's going to go ahead and get some nice targets uh, dotted as SYN starts pushing out towards Boom. We have a player down at this moment. It's going to be play patient. Zeros has really good angles here with the shotgun. He's able to end the first one. I think he's going to get downed here. 3v3, Yogurt able to pick off blowing Zeros. Is that was play with Rockets? This round really shouldn't have played out this way, unfortunately, uh, with Boom control. Um, you know, there should be no reason that, that you lose the round. Uh, so unfortunately, it didn't didn't go in their favor this time. Demi Falcon is going to try and uh, clutch it here. But there comes a rocket in. Really nice boom. Uh, trying to pick him as he picked it up. Well, there's a nice tag tag kill with the frag. So oh, that'll make you bet out of shape in the morning. <laughs> in Demi's favor here. See if he can rip the skull and, and keep keeping things alive. But a 1v1 snipe battle. 2v1. Rob, somebody once said something about you being a, a, a king of nade tagging on Fuel Depot back in the uh -huh. old years of War As days. I've said, you do whatever, uh, you know, to increase your odds of playing. And, you know, if the game's going to exploit the uh, the distance for, yep. uh, for frag tagging, you take advantage of it. Absolutely. So, just like that, SYN.